Hello and what's up camera geeks, this is Goldface Kuza. In this video I'm going to be unboxing my Nikon D5200 DSLR camera which I got from Great Eastern for around $600. It's my first DSLR camera which I'm going to be using for my cinematography. It's going to be my primary cinema camera for my upcoming uh, short films and skits. So let's just move on to the unboxing now. So as you can see the sealed box right there, company sealed, comes with two years warranty. I'm just gonna turn it around so you can see the packaging, the cover. This is the D5200 and I got a 8 GB memory card with that and a DSLR bag. It comes with this VR vibration reduction feature which is really awesome. It comes with this 1855 mm vr mark ii kit lens which is okay for beginners the camera is a mid-range camera let's open the seal it's, it's off and we first we have the documents and everything that looks like a, a promotion card for its products those are, I guess, the address of the service centers. And then there's a warranty card and terms and conditions of service and all. There are two discs inside. This, I believe, is uh, some software for viewing the photos and videos. And this is digital reference manual. Next is the user manual. Next is the hard copy. I'll need to look into that, get used to its features and everything. Let's move into the hardware stuff. First, we have the TV cable, TV output cable. And then we have the USB cable. It looks like it has a different port, not a universal one. And then we have the Nikon shoulder strap, neck strap, I guess it, yeah. That's the lens and, and the charger in there. Let's see the charger. I'm gonna unpack it and mount it a bit for you guys. There you go, the charger. Just plug in the battery right there and it's good to charge. I'm gonna pop out the camera and the, the, the lens. Let's see. Looks pretty compact. It can. And there's the front cap, front lens cap, and there's the rear cap. Let's uh, rotate it around, show you guys what it looks like. You can see the VR option. The focus option, Nikon 1855mm VR Mark II lens, kit lens. Let's keep that aside and we're gonna move on to the big guy that is the D5200 body. Well, it's not as heavy as I thought it would be, it's pretty light. It has a flip screen. LCD display. I'm gonna keep the box aside. Just have a look at the body. Now there's the lens mount cap right there. I'm gonna open that. Put a twist. Like that. You can see the single mirror in there. You can see that. That is. It's completely open, it's vulnerable to dust really. Let's open the rear cap of the lens. And well, cool. The front cap. You can push it in and pull it out. Yep, that is it. Let's have a close look at the camera, uh, the lens. Now we'll keep 
features and everything where you can make it to five and then it comes with the purchase range of 3.5 to 13 f-stop let's mount the lens we're gonna match the white dots and then push it in and twist it and anti clockwise dots matched and there it is done lens has been mounted that's the tripod mount screw thing let's open the LCD since we're stuck and there it is push it back in done there it is I'm recording this on a Samsung um, I'm sorry a Sony Handycam it's been with me for five years now I'm dishing it let's turn it on yep whoa the interface looks pretty good better than D5 100 I gotta push the button in and turn it clockwise and there it is that is I guess that's the cap for viewfinder I'm not gonna be using it anyway let's put that aside and oh the flash just popped up what do we have next um, the, the memory card the HGB SanDisk memory card Good stuff. It's 30 Mbps. And does it go in somewhere near the side, I guess? Yeah, right here. Yeah, I think that's that. Let's just put it in. Yeah, done. And yep, it's good and running. Those are all the buttons, the ISO shutter speed, perch and everything that's the power on button I see the battery slot it's down there I'm just gonna take it out for a couple of seconds take a look at it there it is nothing much, nothing much to look at I'm gonna put it back in Turn it on again. You can see all the sh main menu, and I think that's the mount for external microphone and external flash and everything. Just click this stuff off there. Is. Yeah, you can see several different ports for all different models. The flash and thing. Rode mics are the best mics compatible with these cameras these Nikon cameras well, let's uh, take a look at the viewfinder you can see the crosshair right there mm. yeah, there's nothing much I can show you about the viewfinder now let's, uh, let's take a look at the side see the VR on off switch I'm gonna set it to on all the time so I'll be shooting videos and VR is very important for that yeah, there's the auto and manual focusing I'm gonna switch to manual always and there's the ring for zooming in and out and that's for adjusting the focus and now let's <coughs> check zoom and focus features Zoom now. Let me adjust the brightness so you can see what's in the screen. Um, I'm zooming in. <clears throat> it's out of focus right now. I'm going to adjust the focus. 
देर इज इन फोकस डी फोकस है फोकस गुड सा गुड the screen is pretty started with all the settings and everything put the brightness back no that's the main menu you can see the big ring the big guy right there um all the different modes a uh, scene mode portrait mode landscape baby kids some um, sports map and everything auto manual stuff that's power button record that red one and everyone that's it mm. that um those are the ports for the H- HDMI ports the USB the TV output the microphone jack you know is pretty much it those are the hooks for touch attaching the neck neck strap and uh, that's the model seal D5200 the lens though looks pretty long for a basic kit it's pretty big compared to base kit it's pretty long you can see that see it looks kind of not that much pretty long good so yeah that's it i want to put the camera right there and i'm going to put the box and everything inside and we can see the bag the slr bag that comes with it it's also a nikon bag it seems quite big for uh, just a dslr camera Doesn't look cheap at all. It's the leather looks fine, spacey, you know. I'm gonna open the strap. The shoulder strap looks quite small. Should have been bigger, I guess. Those, um, I guess you put the cables and everything in there. Uh, the chain things are connected together. You pull them together. Okay. No, it's a single chamber. They're all joined. It's a single big chamber. They're divided into two parts. I guess one for the lens, another for the body. I guess you put the CDs or the paper documents and everything in there. So that's it. It's a good bag. Although we can opt for better bags. So that's it for the unboxing and hands-on review thing. Uh, I'm just gonna show it to you on bonds and. That's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Found this boxing useful. And until next time, see y'all. Goodbye.